Hello and welcome back. Okay, let's see. It's about 6.58 right now in Arizona. So, you know what? Let's get going here. Uh, I'm going to shout out to uh, DJ Rippon. Uh, he corrected me yesterday. Uh, I did a video on the static issues for the, my niche grinder whenever doing the uh, direct dosing. So, the technique I used uh, was this called water droplet technique actually the I, I say WDT the actual name for that is the RDT this Ross uh, droplet technique WTT is the wise it's called wise uh, distribution technique so anyway uh, thank you for correcting me there uh, DJ so this morning I'm gonna show you my morning routine so whenever I'm not making YouTube video so whenever I'm not making YouTube video or in Instagram stuff I usually get up around 5 o'clock in the morning, I turn on the machine, and then I do other things, check my email and, you know, do my Instagram thing. So because I do have a full-time job, as you guys already know, so, so this morning I'm going to make myself coffee. Uh, I like to use double shots, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use the uh, spouted uh, photo filter. So one goes to the, my Americano. And then I like to do another one for my cappuccino. So, but meantime, I like to just warm up the cup first, like this. Just like warm it up. So, by the way, uh, you see that all the milk, um, the water is kind of like murky there because. Even though they're pretty clean inside, the inside the group has still it has the, all the old uh, copy, the what's that called, the oils in there. So, I mean, you might want to clean it maybe once a week or so. I mean, that, that's what I like to do. So, I'm, I'm just going to dump this water. And so, this one. The, by the way, the great thing about the life. I mean, I cannot make any mistake. Actually, it's not a mistake, but I mean, with my YouTube videos, whenever I don't like to shot, I can just edit it. But with the live, I mean, what you see is what you get. So let's see here. We got some comments there. Uh, man, I can't even see it. Hold on. So whenever I flush it, I like to just, you know, wipe clean inside with my towel. And then let's see, I'm going to use, I'm gonna uh, open up a brand new bag this morning. I'm gonna use my uh, friends from Good Brothers. Uh, he sent me Indian monsoon, so let's try this bean. So this is brand new bean, uh, brand new. So I mean, comes to grinder setting for new beans, all the machines are different, okay? But like mine, I usually start with the number eight on the side, and then I like to just go adjust up or down. So I know some of you are having a lot of issues with the grinder setting, but uh, just let me know. Follow me on Instagram so I can help you. It's a lot easier to help you through Instagram than uh, YouTube. So. All right, so I'm going to measure out 17.5 gram. The, another reason for that is the retains beans inside has a uh, different space between. So if I put 17.5, sometimes I get around 17.2 or 3. So. And as long as under 17.5, I'm okay with it. Let's see, someone asked me a normal roasting. Yeah, I do still roast at at work, but you know, I'm but I'm I've been getting a lot of beans from other roasters. So meantime, I'm just like to use their beans for now. Okay, so whatever brand new beans, I like to just get a handful of beans, toss it in there, just flush out from the yesterday beans. By the way, it's early morning here, but I know my friends in Australia, there's almost midnight there, so have a great evening over there as well. That's my friends in UK. Let's see, it's about three o'clock in the afternoon, so I mean, thank you so much for watching my video. I mean, I have viewers from all over the world, so it's really fun. Fun to share my uh, coffee with you guys. Let's see. 
So this morning I'm not going to use uh, no niche grinder. I'm just going to use my built-in grinder. I think it's a lot easier for me to use this one than niche grinder uh, whenever I use uh, brand new beans. So because this one you got to dial it in just right. But this one, I only have like 16, 16 different settings. So, I mean, odds of getting dialed in, you know, average, it's, all, it's pretty good. So, just make sure I got the dosing cups a little dirty. So, clean up. Okay, so 17.5 gram. So by the way, so what do you guys your uh, choice of coffee in the morning? You guys like to drink Americano or espresso or latte? Uh, let me know in the comment. Because I like to do half and a half. I like to do a uh, single shot of latte. And it's not, not the latte, cappuccino. And the single shot of Americano. So we got cappuccino and latte, Jack. Okay. I got 17.5 gram in. Just make sure I wipe it clean. So, I mean, I got this dosing photo from one of my viewers. Uh, he's selling on the Amazon. That's the best invention he ever did. So, pretty good. So anyway, how's the weather in Australia? Because I know you guys are freezing cold up there. So this is around 17 point, maybe two or three gram. So I'm just gonna tap it. So by the way, I'm going to, meantime, I'm gonna heat up my hot water. The reason I don't use this hot water because I like to get really boiling hot. So I just got myself Uh, this Delonghi kettle. I got this one from the second and uh, second and store for what ten dollars, I think. So it was a good buy. I'm just gonna start it up. They're really fast, by the way. And then let's see. I'm gonna prepare for the shots. Let's see. Oh, hopefully, you guys can see it. There we go. Water is ready already. I'm just gonna use my St. Anthony's tool. So water is ready to go. Let's see here. Let's see, we got some comments. Okay. I'm just gonna flush. Once more. I usually measure out my shots, but this morning I'm not going to. But ideally you do. You don't want to measure out and time it. But I'm just gonna I'm just gonna wing it. Okay, so I got my cappuccino cup and my Americano cup. Okay, let's see what happens here. Okay, so shot looks good. We got lots of cremas coming out. Hopefully you guys can see it. Looks amazing. Perfect. I mean, look at the shot of crema. Okay, if you guys like crema, goodness, uh, again, try out Good Brothers Coffee. I got a 25% coupon, okay? So th this is not a sponsored video. And uh, he does a really good job, so. 
And this meantime, I'm gonna put hot water in it. Hold on. So this is my morning Americano. I'm just gonna make it right now. So that's my morning Americano. I'm, I'm just gonna set aside for now. And then, uh, meantime, I'm going to make my cappuccino. I'm gonna start my, let's say steam one there. Because you have to do really uh, quick because you don't wanna get, get cold. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna be using oat milk this morning. I'm gonna do the minor figures. So you only have about a couple, about three or four seconds. So when you start steam, so make sure you gotta time it. So now I have to start all over again to watch. And then I'm going to start steaming. I'd like to introduce about five seconds of uh, air. And then the hissing sound there. And then I'm going to submerge it and uh, heat up the hot water, uh, heat up the milk. So it's going to be a single shot uh, cappuccino. Uh, is there any of you guys put any uh, sugar in it on your cappuccino or latte? And sometimes whenever I use uh, use the milk base, milk actual milk, I like to use that like caramel syrup. But most times I just drink you know just uh, milk and uh, espresso. That's it. Just a, just regular, just plain cappuccino. So it's almost, milk is there. Okay, and make sure, make sure you gotta wipe it. And flush. Okay, let's see. Yep, some, uh, some of you just like to drink plain. So lately, I mean you guys see me all the time, I like to transfer the milk for my latte art. Uh, there's no particular reason for that because I've been watching a lot of latte art video from uh, GB Jack and GB does usually do this so that doesn't mean it's gonna make me a better latte artist maybe not but I'm just gonna make some latte art here anyway the milk looks good okay let's do some latte art here we go Okay, I mean, milk looks good, but... The real question is, how's it taste? I thought espresso looks great. And let's see, the milk, you know, has good texture behind it. So hold on, I need a spoon. So this is the uh, uh, minor figures cappuccino with uh, Indian beans. Okay, cheers. Wow. Okay, so I did try with Oatly and minor figures the comparison. Let's see, that was a yesterday video I think, and I thought Oatly has a lot more fat content than this, but minor figures has more the sweetness in the milk so anyway uh, if you guys try both uh, just let me know which one you guys like the best uh, so far I'm so far I'm lean toward to minor figures but I'm not just saying that because I got for free but I mean personally I like the those sweetness of it I mean not as the I don't want to say greasy but minor figures somewhat the lighter 
but I mean, I like both, okay? I like Oli and minor beers, so. Okay, so now, so once I finish drink my cappuccino, and then I like to enjoy my uh, Americano in the morning, so. And then I usually drink about maybe like 20 and 30 minutes long, the time frame, just sip it around, just hang out before I go to work. Anyway, so we got the, I know someone likes the soy milk too. I tried the soy, I'm not that crazy about it, but here's my Americano. Man, this cup is a little warm, so cheers. Wow, it's really good, really smooth. You know what? It's nothing like, nothing like if you dial in just right and it's, coffee's not, it's not, coffee's not taste like coffee, more like nice dark tea. I mean, that's what I like, you know? I know some of you really like the really bold flavor, but personally I like, you know, something lighter flavor. Anyway, I hope you guys like this uh, live stream and let me know if this is something you guys would like to see more often or just give me some suggestion. Maybe, thing is okay, this is my kitchen plus my cup studio. So what I can do is somewhat limited, but maybe I, maybe next time I, maybe I guess, uh, take you guys to like local coffee scenes to some live show there. And again, so let me show you my kitchen studio. Did I say kitchen studio? So this is it. So here's my coffee area. And then I usually put my, oops, I think you saw my wife over there hiding. And what, let's see here, I got here's my cups here on the top. I got my hot water and pretty much it. I hope you guys like this video and, okay, so by the way, someone said my camera setup, so my camera is my old iPhone 6S, 6S, so, that's it. I have no microphone set up right now. Nothing else. I just uh, just a phone. And I do uh, use the Canon those small M50 camera for my YouTube videos. Anyway, and see you guys maybe in the next few days.